2022 has been a pretty big year for Prodigy updates. There were quite a few updates to the game. Many more pets were added, the art style of the wizard was changed, and the current arena seasons started going downhill. In this video, I will be sharing my opinion on the top 5 best updates Prodigy has given us in 2022. These are my favorite updates of the year, and they don't have to be yours. Let me know your top 5 in the comments. Let's start off with number 5. Number 5. The World Stores Update. This update appeared on my account in the later half of September 2022. It had started appearing on accounts a bit before that. Instead of having to go to a certain island to access a certain shop, you are now able to access the shop through your hotbar. This update allows you to view 8 shops whenever you want without having to go anywhere. Just click on the shop you want to visit and you're there. Click view more stores to go back. This update is still in beta testing, not every account has it yet. This update would be higher on the list if Prodigy had added every shop to this World Stores update. I hope that they do in the future once this update comes out of beta testing. There are still plenty of shops around Prodigy missing, and hopefully they will all get representation with a second page being added. So that is number 5. Number 4. The Wizard Reskin Update this update started on August 30th, 2022, and it is still going on right now. It completely changed the art style of the Wizards. Back in late 2021, Prodigy started releasing their newest items in a new form that was not pixelated. We call this HD. When the character reskin update happened on August 30th, all of the outfits and wands got updated to this HD form. There were already some furniture, items, buddies, boots, other gear items that were in HD. But when this update came out, everything started being transformed into HD. We recently got all of the hats updated. The mounts were also updated. And as of right now, the update is still continuing with the boots, and it's being assumed that the buddies will come next. This update completely changed Prodigy once again, and many people did not like it. I am one of the ones who like it. Everything is being transformed. I prefer this HD version over the old pixelated version. Everything they are adding into the game currently is in HD, and it looks better to me than they would in Pixels. To me, this was a great update, but it is far from finished. I believe that eventually the entire game will be updated to be HD, like Lamplight Town would not look the same as it does right now. But because of the inconsistent updates, this has to be number 4 on my list. Number 3, the Ice Titan. In late 2021, the Storm Titan was finally added to the game. This meant that four of the five elements had a Titan associated with them. It was just a matter of time before the Ice Titan was released. And sure enough, on August 15th, 2022, the Ice Titan was released. Each element now had a Titan. This really settled my OCD on that situation. The Ice Titan looks very cool, and put the 5th Titan set in the shop. It was once doubted that Prodigy would ever add an Ice Titan, because on the map, with Crystal Caverns at Shiverchill Mountains, there might not have been room for the Ice Titan icon to be on there. Now of course, this looks different now due to another beta update, but Prodigy made it happen. The Ice Titan was added. And since I appreciate this update so much, it is number 3 on my list. Number 2. The Boots Update This is the most recent part of the reskin update that is going on in Prodigy right now. Not long ago, Prodigy updated several of the boots in the game. This was the first time that boots had ever been updated since they were first introduced into the game. Just like the initial update allowed you to see wands, this update allows you to see boots. The boots were reskinned and made so that you could actually see them on the wizard. This is a very important update and very cool as well. 
I am glad that boots are finally getting more attention, and this is my second favorite Prodigy update of 2022. Before I reveal my top pick, here is an honorable mention. This year, Prodigy has started adding small tasks to the festivals. It started with Winterfest 2022, where they had sort of a testing update where you could do battles each week to earn a reward. This got changed a bit during Springfest, making it so that it was possible to get all of the rewards in one day instead of having to wait each week to get a new one. The rewards are diverse and usually very neat. As of right now, all of the festivals except for Starlight Festival have had this update. I really do like this update and it would probably be number 6 on my list. Number 1 the new Titan Shard system. Titan Shards have always been an extremely difficult currency to get many of, but this update solved that problem. In early April 2022, a new system for gaining Titan Shards was introduced. Instead of the old method where you had to do a certain amount of battles to receive a certain amount of Titan Shards in your mailbox after the Titan was defeated, you were able to get large amount of titan shards after doing a pretty small amount of battles. This is a much more efficient way of getting titan shards, especially with more titan sets being added to the shop. Unfortunately, the old method returned with the addition of the ice titan into the game. I believe that this was an accident, and I hope that this system is added back into the game very soon. I prefer this update so much more than the old method. And I'm sure many people do as well. So, on my list, it is number 1 of the top 2022 Prodigy updates. What do you think about my list? What are your top 5 favorite updates that Prodigy released in 2022? Let me know in the comments. I hope you all have a happy new year, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more Prodigy content.